Hello and welcome back to The Wolf Among Us part number two. If you missed the last part last night, go and check it out. Um, basically gives you a little bit more of a premise of what's going on at the moment. So this is episode three and we're trying to find some uh, some clues on where the hell Crane is and what he's up to. Um, I guess the first place we look is his desk. I reckon so anyway. I've actually got three like, long messages on there. Um, I, I never know whether to read these things on like walkthroughs and stuff. I don't know. Um, you said you'll pay... To have the plaster be done on my building after the last uh, incident in 204. It's falling off the fucking wall. Please fix it. I can't rent the room as it's uh, uh, for days. Not to mention you already promised me you'll send someone to fix the big crack in the glass on the front door. Well, guess what? It's worse now. Get your shit together, Mr. Toad. Wow. Mr. Toad is angry. He's really angry. <laughs> this one crane boy blue um, mm, mm, air conditioning in the unit uh, uh, uh. it's all like for quests and stuff isn't it that was three months ago to get the air fix wow that was um that was quite a long time ago oh, what's in this drawer is it jammed anymore <laughs> just oh this looks like it could be interesting I'll quickly look at this last note see right. I guess I guess these notes might be pointless I don't know um, are there any updates on the extra funding I requested as I explained in my last letter the conditions here could do with some improvements I'm seeing some unrest from the residents uh, 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 I'm sure you're very, very busy I think this should take my priority okay, sweet. did Crane ever do any work only when Cole was around. Yeah, he didn't sound like he'd done much. He sort of just... Did he just sit there? So what seven. Is it? It's the key to his room at the open arms. You still That's haven't told me what suspicious. was in there. You don't want to know, really. I want to know. I need to know. Crane was, uh, paying Lily to live out a fantasy. Of him and you, together. You... Forgive me if I spare you the details. I keep thinking back. I keep replaying moments in my head. Interactions with him when he'd catch me in the elevator or bump into me outside. There's only so much you can repress, you know? Wow, this is getting weird. You couldn't have known. Snow, so you, you couldn't have known. No, I could have. Come on, me, let's keep it? looking. Right. Let's look inside this book then. What's going to be inside? Whoa, sucker. There's What's a, it? It's a fairy tale. It's, it's, torn it's, out. it's a fairy tale. Oh, yeah? Buffkin, do you know what was here? Hmm. It's a ring, at least. Every magical item not retained in the armory is assigned to someone in Fable Town. It must be this witch he is going to see. Wait, what? What witch? What meeting? Well, he called up somebody. He said he needed to see his witch, or that he would need to get to the witch for that. Whoever that is. Well, What's yes, it sounded like the one he got his, uh, you glamours from. I'm sure it's about this ring. They must have it. Why not mention this before? No one asked me. Buffkin! And I'm hungover. I'm sorry. He set the meeting at 2 a.m. tonight. 2 a.m.? What's going on? Is the mirror fixed yet? Bluebeard, this isn't the time. Is the mirror fixed or isn't it? You called I me I called to just to see if you knew where Crane could be, and that was it, okay? And I'm sorry I said anything more than that. Well, you did, and I know. The cat's out of the bag. So, can we find the dull pervert or not? I tried this to, but... This isn't your concern. No, it can't be fixed. It's missing a piece. This is none of Bluebeard's business, Bigby. None of my business? Crane's the murderer. He escaped. It seems he spoiled your every attempt at locating him. And now it's none of my business? We don't know if he's the murderer. Oh, please. Of course he is. Look, this just isn't the time. He took a piece of the mirror so we can't use it. The only thing we know is that Crane's going to see a witch at 2 o'clock. A.M. or P.M.? A.M. 
Listen, Bluebeard, you're not a part of this. I don't think you're in any position to turn away help. Define help. Why do you even care about this? Why? I'm invested in this enterprise we call Fable Town. <laughs> Literally invested. Since it's mostly my money that keeps the whole thing running. And tonight I hear that Crane has been killing Fables? And there's no system in place to catch him? Look, we know that Crane is going to see a witch, and it's to acquire a magic ring. What's the ring? We don't know what it does or who it's assigned to since Crane tore its page out of the book. This farce was your ridiculous idea for a plan. I mean, who put you in charge in the first place? Fixing the mirror was the most logical You're thing. You're a secretary. He's the sheriff. And none of you were chosen to run this office. Who elected you to make these decisions? Nobody, but that Who doesn't... elected her to spend my money? Well, I've been doing that unofficially for years now. Unofficially is not officially. I'm heading up the investigation, okay, Bluebeard? That makes this a moot point. And somebody needs to run the business office while he does so. Well then, excuse me for having the Commonwealth in mind. <sighs> All right, let's just look on the bright side. We know Crane is going to see the witch that's been supplying him black market glamours. Thanks to me. And that he'll be there at two. So that gives us... A few short hours to find out who it is, and where they live, and get them all at once. And a few shorter hours, the more you babble about it. We haven't been the ones babbling. 2 a.m. Piece of cake. Since Lily used the glamours, she'd have known who the witch was. And I don't think Holly's burned her things yet. It would probably have the address, or a phone number, or something. And Bigby is free to go there if he likes. But I think the question you should be asking is just what do the two Tweedles know about this? It doesn't matter what they know. After tonight, they'd never go to their office. They're not smart enough to try and go anywhere else? The Trip Trap is the better option to track the witch down. That has to be our focus. Even if they're not there, the Tweedles' office might have something on Crane. Or the witch. I don't really care what you two do. I'm going to his apartment. What? You can't just go up there. And why the hell not? We already looked for the key, remember? I don't know where it is. Then I'll pick the blasted lock! <sighs> I've wasted enough time waiting for the mirror to find him. I won't waste any more. You just can't go up there alone, all right? I've no interest in nicking his drapes, my dear, if that's what concerns you. What concerns me is you traipsing through possible evidence. Oh, now it's evidence. Before you had no interest, and now it's a crime scene. We can't just let Bluebeard run amok in Crane's place. Ha! He's after something. I just don't know what it is. We have to find the witch, Bluebeard, since that's where he's going. Or oh, the sniveling weasel chickened out. Never went anywhere. And is upstairs right now in his pitiful penthouse, crafting a fort out of couch cushions. Look, this is how a smart person would do it. So this is how we're going to do it. Wherever you go, I'll go to the other. I don't like you going anywhere unsupervised. He's up to something. I don't know what it is, but we don't have the time to really worry about it now. I agree. It does look a bit dodgy. Where are you going to go, Bigby? Oh, uh, where'd I go? Uh, so I think I've got the decision to make now. Where we go first? Find the witch. Oh, boy. So you leave Crane alone, and we leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy and I don't need charity. Oh man, where the hell do I go first? I don't think it's going to be in his apartment. Um... Oh man, I don't know where to go first. Uh, I really want to go to the D's office as well, though, because they are such a bunch of idiots, and I really want to just revenge them. I want to... They shot me, pretty much. I just want to get revenge on that. I want to go with... I want to go with Crane's apartment, I think. Crane's place is right here. I should check that out first. Perfect. And I'll go to those two imbeciles' office. Crane's penthouse number is 1903. Let me know what you find. I hope you know what you're doing. 1903, okay. So that was a tough decision, not really sure whether that was the right one or not. I may do like some other videos like showing the um the other options as well. If you wanna see that or not, let me know in the comments. Right.
903, it's 902. 903, oh god, it's the shorty. Hello? Anyone Anybody? in there? I guess not. Crane? He's not gonna be in, is he? He'd be so, like. So, got one hour and 55 minutes left. That's game time as well. <laughs> not real time. Whoa! There he is. Why would you have a statue of yourself? Damn it. Must have missed him. There's gotta be something about his witch here. So, we have to look around. Um, I can't. Oh, I was over here. Oh, a picture. Is that him? <laughs> was that doorbell? Did I hear a doorbell? I, I, I don't know if I, was that my house or was that? <laughs> I was yeah, sure I had science, that. history. If I had to guess, this shit didn't work. Yeah, the one, what's, the, who's, what's his picture I've of? I've never seen him that excited. Okay, guess so things have changed. Oh. Must have gone down here. There's a key out there as well. This is one weird apartment. I don't know. Anyone that has like a statue of themselves is a bit weird. If I'm honest. This hasn't been used in years. What's this? Merry Christmas, Mr. Green. I forgot. He used to teach in the old days. Hmm. What's this? Um, we can look at this. There's a message. Oh, sweet. Play the message. It's because I love you. What the hell? That's a weird no. That cannot be. That doesn't sound right. What money? Crooked man. This is all I could get. I'm afraid Snow will start to notice. I'll have the rest for you next week. Ichabod Crane. What's going on here? It's getting really weird. Let's leave the money. I always think leaving it is probably the best idea, I guess. Taking it can put you in the frame, maybe. I don't know. Might be useful. Be very careful. Right. Horsey. What are you doing? Is that him there? The headless horseman. <laughs> Alright. So, yeah, if you didn't know, this is basically based off like fairy towels and stuff. Hence, snow is snow white. Stuff like that. Um, Beauty and the Beast in there as well. We saw it earlier. Right, where else are we going now? I think we searched everywhere in there. For, I, th I think we have anywhere. Towards this, but right down here, oh, statue of himself, of course. That is weird. Really? <laughs> yes, that guy was. Really? You, you, you sure about that? Can we open that chest with the key? No. And here. Oh, oh yes, use the key. Hopefully it works. Yes! 